today's beading class. In today's class, we are doing a daisy vine bracelet, and that is it. Okay, so let's get on with it. The length of my thread is 60 inches long and I'm going to be beading on a single thread. So I'll leave some working thread in the end. So I'll just pick on any bead to be my bead stopper thread and then we'll start beading from there. So just any regular bead, go over it again and that will save us your bead stopper just that and then we carry on I have my three different seed beads I have my toggle and bar and my jam ring in gold so my gold beads these ones this metallic one is going to be for the vine and then I'll use this for the daisies and this will be for the petal okay so let's start so you start off with six of my gold I'm going to pick one six six okay two four six and then I'll get on four of these four and then one of that so that goes in the center of the work and I push it all the way down push it all the way down now you see that one two three four that is my uh, flower bead okay my flower bead is one two three four and I'm going to come in like that to the last very last one okay and then pull my needle so I'll have that you get it then pick on again on my flower beads three more one two three three and then I'm coming through the last flower bead seated close to the white bead. Okay, and then I'll bead it like that. Then I'm going to pick on again on I'm going to pick on again three of my gold bead. Three of my gold bead and come all the way through the six beads I started with way through all six and then pull it. So this is what I have to start off with I'm going to carry on like that so for the next step I'm going to pick four of my gold then four of this one so four gold four blue one white send it all the way down then bring my needle round through the last blue bead here pull it my thread then pick on three more blue three more of these and then put it through the blue that sits very close to the white one
Then I'm going to string on three more of these gold beads. And bring and then count six beads from the petal we just did. One, two, three, four, five, six. So my six beads here. So one, two, three, four, five, six. And go through all six. Turn it over and bring it to this end now. Pick on four gold. So it's four gold, four blue, one white, four gold, four blue, four blue. one white so as you can see four gold four blue one white push it all the way down okay and then i'll bring it through the last blue at the bottom here So I'm going to pick up three more blues. And then put it through the blue that is seated very close to the white. And then I'm going to put it like that. Then the next step is to pick on three gold. Pick on three go and bring it all the way through the six beads here. So I'll count one, two, three, four, five, six. And I'm going to go through all six. Okay, so let's go over it one more time. I'm going to pick on three gold beads pick on three gold beads then i'm going to bring it all the way through six beads so from the petal i've just done i'm going to count six beads and i'm counting one two three four five six so i'm going through this bead all of the six all six i'm going through all six beads then i'm going to pull it my thread okay when i pull my thread i'm going to turn it rotate it to this end now and then we pick on four more beads gold beads four blue beads and then one white bead to serve as the center piece send it all the way down okay then bring my needle so i have the white bead here and then i have my four blue bead so i'm going to bring my needle to my fourth blue bead like that so it's going to go in out okay and then you pull it when you pull it and then you pick on three more of the blue 
put it through the glue bead up here. Okay, I'm going to put it through the glue bead up here. And then I'll pull it. And that caps the flower or the daisy. When I've done that, the next step will be picking on three of my gold beads. And then sending it through six beads here. I'm going to send it through six gold beads. So from the petal, I'm counting six gold. One, two, three, four, five, six. Put it there. And then pass my needle through all six beads. And then I'll pull it. So that is it. And I'll turn the whole thing. So it's beading one petal here, one petal here, one petal here, alternatively. So now I'm going to be doing my next petal on this side. So when I turn it, and then I come and bead my next petal on this side. So as I bead, I keep turning until I finish. Okay, so, so when you get to the it. end, you bring your thread all the way here into into two of the pair of blue petals at the top. Okay, like that. Pick on six of the gold beads so where you've just come out from so I'm bringing it back through this top bead you bring it back through this top bead you have this seated on top I'm going to go round this a couple of times to make it firm because we are ending it there so you have to make sure that that bit is firm okay I'm going to send it down a few steps down so that is it with one side finished now I'm just going to twist my jam ring slide that end into it at the other end of my toggle inside and then twist it back close I'm going to carry on and finish it at the other end as well so the same way you get your stopper bead off then I'll string this end That is why it's always good to leave some working thread when you are starting off because you come back and finish it up there. Okay, so string this and get all six beads just like we did at the other end. I'm going to go in this way as you can see. Go through that little of times I can okay. okay. so I'm going to open my jam ring slide it in slide the other end of my toggle in 
okay bring it back together so that is it we've come to the end of today's project hope you enjoyed it if you did give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to share as well as subscribe and hit on the notification bell so that anytime we upload a new video you'll be able to get your notification have a lovely day until we meet again bye